In this video, I'm gonna go over the makes framework that helps me find Airbnbs that get booked all year round. Number one, is the market active at least nine months out of the year? So this relates to seasonality. There are some markets like Park City, Utah, where there are huge bookings during the winter months, but they're very slow during the summer months. Now the winter months may make up for it for the slower months, but for me, I like to have a consistent revenue stream throughout the year. So what ultimately matters is if at the end of the day, the numbers work out for you. Number two, does a city or area have attractions? I check if the area has some sort of draw or attraction nearby. For example, if there's a beach nearby or some famous tourist attraction. If this isn't the case, then don't worry about it. The goal here is to narrow down to a few markets as fast as possible. Number three, if I was browsing Airbnb, why would I book this property in particular? Ideally, your property should have something that stands out from other properties like a hot tub, sauna, game room, etc. Number four, can you create an experience with a property? For example, it's a located near a lake or a canal. I do this so I can help make it a memorable experience for my guests. In general, I look for properties that can stand out like having a pool, vaulted ceilings, and so on. And apart from this, I always look at tourism trends before investing in any market. You can find this data on Google. Just search for area tourism statistics and stats help you make an informed decision instead of making blind assumptions. I also like to check what things there are to do in the area. Sounds simple, but makes a world of difference. Truth is, you're not gonna find a market where you're booked every single month because if your occupancy is more than 90%, it means that you're not charging enough, so don't overcomplicate it. 